Hey you guys, welcome to another session by Scalar where we are going to understand the difference between a developer and a tester. Do you wish to make your career in web development? And because of the field of information technology and web development is so vast, you may be confused about what career path you should be choosing. Every profession has its own benefits. If you choose to be a developer or a tester, you must have full knowledge about it. There are several skills you must possess if you wish to become a developer or a tester. You must have basic knowledge about computer sciences and their application. A problem solving skill that helps you resolve issues. Knowledge about coding and how it can be implemented. A knack for learning about new technologies. In this video, we are going to learn everything about developers and testers. We will explore their roles and responsibilities and understand how they contribute to the development of websites. You can subscribe to our channel if you want to receive all notifications and never miss out on any of our videos. Without any further ado, let us start with the session. Who is a developer? A software developer, as the title suggests, is someone who creates and maintains computer programming source code in order to create new software. A developer is responsible for enabling specific computer device functions for the user. They help in maintenance and updating of the program. A developer creates every component of programming from scratch, then plans how it will all come together and create the finished product. What does a developer do? Software development involves programming language, which is the act of writing and preserving program codes. But it now encompasses everything that occurs between creation of respective application and its final representation, preferably a systematic and organized manner. The software development process might involve research, new development, experimentation, customization, repurposing, re-engineering or indeed any operations that produce software application. A software developer is responsible for all phases of software development from the initial concept through the final validation process. What are the roles and responsibilities of a developer though? You will need a great deal of experience and knowledge in website and application development to succeed as professional developer. The expertise that developers provide to a team is unmatched since it is essential to websites overall operation. They are well versed in designing system administration and application frameworks. Let us have a look at roles and responsibilities of a developer. In order to build a project, a developer must obtain all the needs and specification from the stakeholder or clients. Separate the requirements into parts and process of each piece of information so that it may be incorporated into websites design and implementation. They need to do a comprehensive study of requirements and search for difficulties that may arise. Also come up with a response to these issues in advance. It is the developer's job to organize appropriate user interaction. Create data sources before beginning website creation is one of the most important techniques. After that, it is simple matter of uploading the file to the server and granting users access. The developer must also evaluate the programs on a regular basis to look at the flaws and mistakes. If anything goes wrong, they are in charge of providing solution as fast as possible. Codes must be updated on a regular basis to reflect changes in hardware and software requirements. In order to come up with alternative solutions, the developer must follow a rigorous testing procedure. Developers should be able to develop applications and websites that can operate on variety of platforms. They are in charge of arranging the logic system, which in turn controls website's overall structure. Now let us discuss who is a tester. A software tester is concerned with determining whether the newly generated software is working correctly, if it is complete, of high quality and error free, ensuring the software reliability. This is critical. It also lowers maintenance expenses and improves usability and functionality. What does a tester do though? Software testing involves a series of actions designed to discover software faults and fix them before the final product is distributed to the customer. To put it in another way, software testing is a process of determining if actual outcome matches the expectation and ensuring that a software system is bug free. A tester does more than merely look for mistakes. A tester checks that the program is working as expected finds bugs and ensures that the user gets what they expected. 
a tester examines a piece of software in order to find discrepancies between the current and the desired circumstances and gauge the software capabilities. Let us now discuss roles and responsibilities of a tester. A tester's primary professional responsibility is to carry out software products testing both manually and automatically. Software bug reduction and error identification should be priority for everyone, regardless of where they work. Testing is a job in tech sector. However, the sort of software that tester evaluates varies from one company to another. As an instance, a tester at one firm may check the graphical interface of a web page while others might check the streaming platforms. Let us see the roles and responsibilities of a tester. Programming testers must first read and understand the different features of software that have been used to perform tests. There is a lot of code to look through, objective to learn and technical specifications to evaluate. QA engineers and software testers must work together to build a thorough test strategy after analyzing the software's parameters. These designs will serve as a reference for experimental analysis. Testers are responsible for carrying out the tests that have, they have designed. Manually or automatically, these assessments can cover any portion of the application and then they can evaluate the complete program. Testers will have to keep detailed records of any faults, malfunctions and defects found over the course of conducting each test. Using this reference, software developers would be able to make further enhancements to the final product. To be effective, software testers must do more than merely look for and report the issues. They will also have to work with programmers to figure out how to address the problems and resolve them. Testing must continue indefinitely after a software application has been revealed to the public or deployed in an enterprise. Thus, the software will continue improving throughout the time. Before you make any career choice, you have to understand the career roadmap of the profession. What will the hiring company expect from you and will the structure of the job be? Stay with us for the next part as we are going to discuss the career roadmap and necessarily skills required as well as the average salary packages so you can become a developer or a tester. Let's discuss career roadmap for a developer. A developer must be well versed in both front-end and back-end platform development. In addition, a thorough understanding of web application is a must. The front-end, back-end, server software, SQL and interface are all handled by developers. Therefore, let us see all skills and knowledge that are required to become a developer. Apart from the expert knowledge about programming languages and tools, a developer must have a mathematical aptitude. The developers need to understand the requirement of the client and provide them with solution. Therefore, a developer must have high skill that allows them to tackle problems easily. The developer always has to work within a given time limit. Therefore, they must have management skills as well as organizational values so that they effectively finish their work within the specified time limits. The developer has to look at and assess every detail. Therefore, they must be able to evaluate every detail and work accordingly. The software developed must be always according to the latest trend and environment. Therefore, they must have an understanding of the latest technology so that they can develop websites that would attract better traffic. The developers must have an understanding of SEO ranking factors. This will help them make the website that would rank higher in the search engine result page. They must always be keen to learn something new and adapt to the changes of the changing world. The developers must have knowledge about several programming languages and tools. Here's a list of all the languages and tools you need to know. Bootstrap, JavaScript, d3.js, angular.js, elixir, react, foundation, html and css, lodash, python, django, ember. Average salary packages for developers. The average salary for a software developer is 6 lakh per year. However, a fresher with no experience can earn a salary package of up to 3 lakh per year. Whereas, someone who has experience can earn up to 9 to 15 lakh per year according to their experience. The roles of your job as a developer can earn you a very high salary as the profession has many job related benefits. Now let us discuss career roadmap for a tester. Successful testers have a keen eye for details and are highly focused on tasks at hand. 
they are great critical thinkers and observers and they can talk to a wide spectrum of individuals in addition to fundamental characteristics and behavioral qualities companies are looking for testers with better programming and analytical abilities therefore let us see all the skills and knowledge that are required to become a tester first of all and most importantly all testers should be well versed in technology they will be evaluating the it sector is frequently seen as a career choice that substantially reduces presentation skills than some other industries however testers must have a strong interpersonal and communicational skill in order to work efficiently alongside cross functional organizations software flaws aren't always obvious it's critical for testers to pay close attention to every detail in order to find even the most difficult to find problems a significant part of testers job is documenting and commenting on the issues they see therefore they should have a strong documentation abilities to fix the bugs they identify testers will have to collaborate with developers and other colleagues testing requires problem solving abilities therefore this is crucial average salary of a tester that you can expect the average salary of a software tester is 5 lakh per year however a fresher with no experience can earn up to salary package of up to 2 lakh per year whereas someone who has experience can earn 5 to 9 lakh per year according to their experiences it is very essential to draw a line where the roles and job specification of the two profession go into different branches in the following session we will focus on the main differences between the two professions let us discuss other main differences between a developer and a tester there are several differences between the two profession let us now understand them in detail a software developer is in charge of development of the software whereas a tester is responsible for analyzing every piece of code and ensuring that everything works correctly a software developer develops software in systematic manner with each phase building on previous one whereas tester assesses a software program's functionality in order to create a piece of software software engineers usually have to write codes on the other hand software tester check to see if the code behaves as planned developers are responsible for increasing the efficiency of the design process and aim to enhance quality of the websites or software whereas testers are accountable for the quality of the software as well as their design and delivery the primary goal of a software developer is to provide error and bug free products whereas the goal of a software testing is to identify any faults or mistakes that may exist in the program developers grasp problems quickly work to enhance business quality cut expenses and boost flexibility among other things however testers report issues as quickly as possible which improves efficiency which also ensures application quality and safety developers do more than just create cutting edge software they also provide recommendation for how to make it work better in addition to finding defects tester also look for underlying cause of such issues so that they may be fixed once and for all the developer must be pro proficient in variety of areas including programming creating code and time management tester must be well versed in system under development have excellent communicational skill and must be able to exercise critical judgment developers frequently create brand new software products in response to customers request however a tester typically works with a new software in order to eliminate or correct mistake if there are any present when it comes to software development developers put the need to of the user first however during software testing testers pay a close attention to end user behavior what are the key takeaways of this session the roles and responsibilities of developer and a tester are varied however it is very important for them to work collaboratively so that the client can have a high quality and bug free product despite of the difference a developer and a tester can closely work together therefore if you are looking for career in any of these fields you will have a secure career ahead we hope that our session on the difference between a developer and a tester benefited you to become more aware of these two professions You may learn more about various top grossing and high end technologies by subscribing to our channel. Click the bell icon to never miss an update from us. Until then, bye bye.